Oh, I pressed. I did it again. I'm holding Y down instead of ZR. What the hell is wrong with me? Old Nintendo Gamer. And son. Hey, you may as well watch this again. Hello and welcome to Old Nintendo Gamer and son as we're running around doing something we did earlier. What are you after, pal? Go away. I don't understand how I can throw a block on the floor there. Oh, go, 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 See you there, pal. Right, I actually had to look up what the hell I had to do here, because, as you know from last video, I didn't know what to do. And I tried the TV and everything, and apparently... You can push the TV on. Absolutely ridiculous, that's a puzzle. After pushing the TV numerous times. Haha, <laughs> right, too soon, too soon. Running too fast. Damn, I should start in that room now though, which for some reason after it said continue, I started not in that room. Even though after this lengthy little load section, I will start in the room. Ridiculous. Let's drink some water while this uh, game tries to load. I was in the room anyway. I don't know why he's got to load. He's got to load in that guy's animation stuff and make sure he's in the right place. Yeah, I see he's not working again. Weird. That's exactly what I thought I had to do, but couldn't. Hello, long arm guy. I surely can't hear me now. Ah, yes, I forgot that there was. At least a save point there, so it seems that I should be pretty safe coming around for the entirety of the rest of this. At least until he decides to attack again. There it is. Exactly what we need this for. Now it's that way again. Okay. There's a good chance you can hear this. But I'm not hanging around to find out, that's for sure. Let's get going. Train, train, eh? St 
steam, eh? Ah. How did I walk past it before then? Huh? I walked straight through it before and then, because I thought it was behind. Come back, are we? Fred, Fred, boy, Fred. Unbelievable. And what a game. You know, this would uh, be good with a, a 3D kind of virtual reality so you can actually tell the depth of things because everything's so dark. It's um, difficult to see where you are in terms of the 3D. Ah, is that floating in space? push it no I can't right, so I can't push it but I can pull it I mean right, so is I could jump up and over or I could just jump across here there we go right there's no way of feathering them in the minute feather them in the man in the man that out come on that can go further there we go let's jump up no jump up jump onto the door These, these are really weird sections of depth perception. And it looks like it's going to break. Let's get across that quickly. All right, okay. Hey, back here, back here, back here, boy. Hey, there's holes in here. There's rats in there. Oh, nice. Damn. <laughs> Use a lighter and burn his hands. Little hands is. Uh, one of those things that uh, you find out. Right, I don't do that next time. I had to sit through a Lord's screen while I found that out. See that um, little kind of a save point, you light it, the candle, it acts like a save point. You never start from it though, do you? See? Not even nowhere near it. Uh, see, I'm behind it, why? Hello, pal. There's a door there, he'll just come through here. I ducked! So infuriating. I pressed the slide button. What happened? I was running full out. And because you chose not so good, you get forced to sit through another 30 second loading screen. Damn you. Only gripe. I think with this game, it's been pretty, you know. Run. This way, pal, this way. So you can't run as fast as me. Oh, come on. Why isn't he sliding now? 
Ah, repeat 30 second load screen. So that is my only gripe is that uh, huge loading time. Can you imagine if it's bump back into the game now? And you could try again. You'd be happy to try six, seven times. But when you gotta wait and wait between each loading time. Only to know that, quite possibly, I'm not going to do it again. No, 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 no. I was trying to put... Alright, okay, I just got to... Ah. Oh. And then work out... Oh, you don't do that either. Don't do that. Just don't do it. Come on, Mr. Uh, Mr. Tickle. I don't think he wants to tickle me, that's for sure. Ah, hey, that's Andy. Surely you can't get me up here. Go away. Wah 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 what? Right in. how the hell am I gonna get over that? At least I didn't have to do the run again, I suppose. Oh, where's Sif, man? Where is Sif? If I could pull that mechanism out, I could squash his ass. I was good getting up on the other part. What the hell am I doing here? I'm just watching him go back and forth. Is he coming back up here again? I reckon I can pull that out.
you dead, pal? You lost your arms? Good. Alright, let's go. I had a feeling that would be it. Sticking your arms through a door that's about to collapse. Ooh, we're into a new area. That probably means we won't see long arms again. At least not with those arms. To a new area. Go, 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 go. Right down. What are we looking at here? Uh, some packing hooks. Whatever I do, don't let go. Oh yeah, there's a moving fat chef up there. All right, did he see me? It's been, it's been an hour since you last ate. Why are you so hungry, pal? What is that? Is that a rat trap? The rats most certainly aren't going for it. Yeah, there's a rat, but then maybe you can eat the rat. Yes, I can eat the rat. Nice. This kid's got what the kids these days call moxie. Kid. And it is this kind of playful, childlike glee of jumping up and onto things. Realizing what you got to do. <laughs> it's like something out of Texas Chainsaw Massacre, man. Whatever meat he's preparing. It's been stagnant and stale for months. No, I just press jump. Up. Oh. No sounded like a shop of knives. Do you reckon he's got hearing like the other one or has he got vision? I suppose we'll find out by dying.
Good, he's a bit stupid by the looks of it. Do you reckon he keeps the key? I don't know, but maybe by coming up here, I'll find out. smash on his stupid head. Now where is this key? Oh, do I need the key? Can I just climb up here instead? to the bathroom even psychopaths I suppose have to go to the bathroom <laughs> yeah it's eating all that child meat by the looks of it The gnomes, the gnomes are everywhere. Let's go and follow that gnome first of all, see what he went to. Mr. Gnome! There's a slug man in here. The chef again. Right, again. Let's in here. Let's jump across. Don't know why I even came in here. Let's jump across here though. Jump across to here. Why the heck am I up here? Can't shimmy across things either. We're gonna get across. <coughs> Top of the door. No, I can't. Why did I even come in here to see that? Stupid gnome. Damn gnomes. Hey, 
it. It's not where I want to go. Further down into the bowels of what this ship is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right, I do need that key, but where the hell is the key? Does that mean the key is back upstairs? Ah, oh, the key could be anywhere. likely to be not in that pot <laughs> Keep a key in your bed, pal. Keep a key in your bed. That looks like something I can grab, but it doesn't show me where it is in relation to 3D space. I can't tell if it's I'm in front of it or behind it. Hmm. It would be interesting if it was interesting, but it's not. I can't even grab the door now and close it. Which means I can't get up there. Where's the key? I don't think a key is in here, is it? I'm going to climb up here one more time. Am I missing? Whoa, 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 what was that on the hook there? The key! Oh dear, I'm gonna die. Oof. <gasps> what a jump! Okay. So hopefully that fat guy is not going to come back. Oh, is he downstairs now? There's two of them. And I've destroyed your pottery. <laughs> Down we go with a key. Now I can't run. Oh, hello, no. I'm gonna leave the key here. I hugged a gnome. Hey. See me. Is 
This is a little nerve wracking. Waiting for him to catch me up, or her. Yay, I'm through the door. Run like crazy, pal, run like crazy. Bloody big knives here. No. Right. Ah, bellboy. A bell hop. The meat grinder. Got a sausage. <clears throat> There's got to be some way for me to get more meat, and I think that way is to go up above. Get a freshly laden carcass. Look at all that meat. And then I'm gonna make a pile of sausages like you've never seen before in your life. Did you know? Oh, it's a freezer cold in here. Oh, maybe I don't have to make a pile of sausages like you've never seen before in your life. Even though I would like to. Damn, some ideas I would like to try out and um, it's not paying fruition yet. Yeah, apparently if you smash those, something else happens as well. Right, what a sh shoddy camera angle that is. What am I supposed to do from here? Looks like a dead no. Yeah, but why? Why? Why am I? I can't grab onto the top of that. That's pumping out the freezer pops. It's freezing for this kid. No socks or shoes on. Um, I don't understand why you're showing me this stupid angle. I got nothing to throw.
can't understand. Games are so weird sometimes they want to right I want you to do this ah let go of Zeta right why would I want to be doing that is to make the meat fall off obviously but um Hey, mommy. Is it going to be enough, though? I'll do that. Um, I don't think it will be enough. Let's see if I can jump that one more time before, because I don't want to go up and down, up and down. I can jump over that one, jump over that one, jump over to that one. Hopefully, I can get two here in one go. Indiana Jones. Oh, I can't even grab onto that. Right, okay. Let's go back downstairs. Why do I need to go in the other room and look at that dead gnome? Bloody weird game. Alright, there's a bigger, bigger piece of meat. Let's have some sausages. Oh, it's that way, right. Are you kidding me? One more sausage. Oops. I can't get up there, can I? Yes, I can. No, oh, I couldn't get up there first time. Right then, how the heck am I going to get this other pile of meat here? I just realized there's a pile of meat here as well. No, I can't see it. Ah, uh, meat as one more sausage. Come on. There's got to be another way to get some more meat in here. I can grab onto that one. 3D space is not this game's grace. Yep, I can't grab onto that whatsoever. Right, let's go and see if one more piece of meat will do. Just one more piece of meat. Is it enough? For me to eat. Ah, look the other one in. Ah, right, I'm not making it. I'm, what I'm trying to do is. Yeah, come on. Swing on those sausages. I somehow don't think that'll be the last we see of that fat chef. But it could be wrong. See, we're still in this enormous meat factory. somewhere to hide another key needed
cheese, moldy cheese. Lovely. Put that in your back pocket. Sorry, you've no proof it was me. You got some serious breathing problems there, pal. Back in the same blinking place. Didn't even know I was here, pal. You didn't even know I was here. The key. <laughs> right, do you reckon I can open this in time? And then find somewhere to hide. Because if you can't see that bright yellow thing down there. Where are you going exactly where I'm going? Following me or something. Alright, down the rubbish shoot. Lovely place to be. Wouldn't light a candle down here though. Highly flammable, you know. All this uh, methane gas giving off. What? This plunger. Can't climb. Oh, oh, yeah, monkey. Just going to check out what, um, ah, yeah, 
ass to have on closer. I was one of the best one man the washing the dishes. My god, they wash dishes. And get through that. Yep, there's a great deal that I can't get through, so I gotta get up and over there. They're gonna see me when I jump up. If they do, oh, I can't get up there because there's a grating on the drain. There's no grating on the drain there. Come in. Can't get up there. I got the hooks working. coming from Lovely human, you. Right, those plates are going to fall on it. What a jump that is. Ah, I made it. gonna get me. Oh shoot! Oh damn that was close. Alright where am I gonna start from? Let's try that again, that was quite nice. Nice little section, as you can tell when I'm uh, concentrating, I don't talk. Woohoo! I quite like it, but it's not scary in the slightest, it's just exciting. Dodge two fat shifts. Oh, that gave me absolutely no time to react then. But at least I know I'm in the right place. I can't jump up over there, so I gotta run for it. 
Is there any way I can hide and oh. Hide under the plates. That's the best place to hide. Run. Run, you fool. Run. Under the table. Ah! Gotta get up onto that box then and jump across onto one of those hooks and hopefully my 3D spatial awareness will allow me to tell me what the hook is before me, in front of me, back to me, left of me, or right of me, and away we go. At least the first part's okay. I just need to run straight across. Not to the front of the box, but maybe to the back of the first box. Let's see. Don't slow down, just keep running. Ah! Yep, I deserve that. Crashing into the first pile of plates. Ah! Do have to go under that table to slow the first chef down. But they're cooking, I don't think I could call them a chef. Sur Surprise they wash the dirty dishes though. Doesn't look like a kind of type of establishment that does that kind of stuff. Jump! Aha! He's away! See you later, fat chefs. Ooh! Right, I, I deliberately. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. It deliberately dropped me off by there, but then there's still a 3D awareness. Why do you allow a 3D awareness, a, a spatial awareness there? I can slightly push too far forward and die. I gotta do all that again. Just drop me off the edge, brother. I'm a livable. Wait for the elephant trumpet. Yep, gotta do it again. Damn it. Now the, now the hooks are in the wrong place at the wrong time. Jesus. Whew. Once I'm over there safely, we should see some sort of uh, loading, saving screen. And we will call it quits on this recording, but I'm going to get damn well get across there before we finish. Jump! I was pressing B to jump and it didn't jump! Ah! Oh. Why didn't it jump? I pressed B three times then to jump on top of that box. Oh, unbelievable. It's because of the soap suds. Sorry, I gotta watch this uh, running section over and over again until I can. See, jump works there. Jump works there. Jump works there! Oh, I let go of Zeta. Oh, 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 I let go of Zeta and B at the same time. I let go of that stupid hook. <sighs> You've gotta be lucky with the placement of those hooks at the end there. Hold the ZR button, don't let go. Yeah, 
Easier said than done, actually. Alright, let's get under this table. Let's see a little fat soap. Oh, I pressed. I did it again. I'm holding Y down instead of ZR. What the hell is wrong with me? ZR's hold. Once again, wait for this loading screen. Try it again, you buffoon. I'm holding Y now to run, and then I press ZL to slide under the table, and then it automatically disappears. Then I'm running with Y, then I press B to jump and hold ZL, ZR to jump there, and I press B and ZR, and now it's in the wrong place. Ah! Damn. Damn, that's not tricky. Just infuriating. Why are you in so intent on? Hold ZR, hold ZR, don't let go, right. Whew! Right now, that's the easy part done. <laughs> that drops me off automatically. I am going very slowly as I don't want to fall. Come on, he's done it. I suppose we are starting another section here. Let me um, let me run on just a little bit, just to make sure that I am in a new section. Right, it's so weird. It's playing like a two D platformer now, but yet it's still a three D platformer. It it hasn't learned from its mistakes. It just needs to. Just push left, push right, you get a slight angle, even a slip off there, and into the foreground or background. Which is quite perplexingly weird and strange of a game design conceit. Hey, we're out of the ship. And we are, that's why we're not rocking much. At a harbour, by the looks of it. Oh, I ship the ship, eh? They're very brave, though, aren't they? Walking across the ship like that. Hey, right, what am I going to do? Try and overthrow the captain here? Mutiny on the bounty? Lovely visuals there. Uh, absolutely delightful. Jesus. See what I mean by the... Ah, oh, right, are they rescuing? Stranded passengers, or are they going to come find the gnomes? There's a lot of people coming in there. And they're all rather on the hefty side. There we go, another big load screen then. I quite like this setting. Seems a little six. I'll have to wait to port. Right, did it save there?
like the camera angles changing and then you gotta ever so slightly change then you gotta ever so slightly change your oh good god they all gonna see me ah we have hit some sort of Japanese architecture here there's a Japanese lady This looks lovely, no? Strange how you'd want to be in charge of all this, isn't it? Landed on her head. I reckon I can still get up there. She hasn't learned that I'm gonna try it again. Right, I think once it shows me where I start from, you're gonna start from there next time. Load, you slow game, load. Yes, we'll start from here next time. So thank you for watching old Nintendo Gamer and Son playing through Little Nightmares. This is part three. We'll be back with part four. Bye-bye. Those lovely sounds of eating. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give us a like if you've enjoyed our content. We're also on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and our private Discord server. Just follow the links in the description below.